Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to download and install Kodi on your Windows computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial. And without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up a web browser. It doesn't really matter which one, but I'm going to open up Google Chrome. And I'm going to navigate over to Google.com. Into Google, you want to type in Kodi. And then just hit Enter. One of the best managers should say Kodi.tv. I'd recommend just going underneath the download section right here and left clicking on that. And then you want to scroll down this page until you get to underneath choose your, your flavor. You want to select whatever corresponding version of your operating system is listed here. I'm going to select Windows because I'm on a Windows computer. And you can either go through the Windows Store or just go through the 32-bit installer, which I'm going to select in this tutorial here. So please be patient, this download will take a little while. You also have the option to go through the Windows 10 store if you chose to do so. Either way will work. Okay, so once it's done downloading, we can run the file. If you receive a user account control window, left click on yes. Left click on next to continue the setup. And once you've looked through the end user license agreement, left click on agree. I'd recommend just left click on next again, next. And I would recommend just keep going with this. And this will begin extracting the files at this point. And once you're done here, you can left click inside this box to run Kodi. Otherwise, just left click on finish. And that should be about it. So, I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. If you do get any uh, firewall notifications, you will want to allow this application through. So just left click on allow access here. And that's pretty much it. So again, thanks for watching, and I will catch you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.